Alrighty, alrighty. Here's the Aki video. See, see the character, guys? See how messed up she really is. I made another video. I made a video, like, her announcement. Like, after you get to see a glimpse of her gameplay, so definitely should check that out. Um, uh, but yeah, let's get started. Let's, let's see how she's, uh, how she plays. Okay. Uh, Aki. Combine snake fist kung fu with poison lace claw attacks plus irregular movements to bewilder the opponent. Her ability to increase her damage using poison makes her a tricky character that's tough to deal with. Okay. She can employ a wide range of tactics such as using poisonous projectiles, utilizing her claw base um, attacks to poke at opponents, and seizing openings created by poison opponents eager to close in. Decision where opponent has closed the gap, drive them away with your quick normal attacks and gain some distance with your movement. When the opponent is hit with certain attacks, there will be poison. Ah, that's what I thought. Oh. Or lose vitality over time. Okay, wait, well, yeah, of course. Poison set will expire naturally after a certain amount of time. It will also end if Aki takes damage. Ah, okay. Hitting poison opponents with certain attacks will also trigger Toxic Blossom, which ups damage and changes the behavior of the targeted triggered move. Wait, hold on. Hitting poison opponents with certain attacks will also trigger Toxic Blossom, which ups damage and changes the behavior of the triggering move. This will allow you to extend combos or create new symbols. Well, let me... Let me see this. Oh, it's like an extra hit or something? Nice shade. Poison's bubble. Okay. If poison opponents making a nice and deadly tool. Yeah, no, it definitely seems like. Nice shade chaser to extend my. Wait, 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 hold on. What? It could be followed up with Nightshade Chaser to extend my talents to detonate. Wait, they got hurt skin. <laughs> uh, to detonate the pulse using this to hit enemies who think they're safe moving around. Wait, hold on, really? Wait, did it really. Oh! Oh, that's. That's nasty. That's sick. So basically. So basically, she can detonate the bubble bubble anytime that she wants. Oh, that's nasty. Um, this is definitely for people that likes to toy with other people during games or like the troll. Um, uh, pulse is shade with chaser can trigger toxic blossom at close range. An effective combination to increase the damage you can deal in certain. Yeah. That's crazy. Guess that's a B and B right there. One more handy thing to remember. You can perform. Okay, so she can. Uh, snake step is like a ability. Wow. Okay. It's just as like she has everything. Overdrive. This version boasts a fast recovery, and the pulse will also hit multiple times. Use it as a shield. Yeah, I peeped that in the, the reveal trailer. That's crazy. Oh shit. Orchid Spring. Pierce the ground, create a pool of poison. If they touch it, they'd be poisoned. Okay. Poison! Get this purple stuff off me. <laughs> Makes it way into the enemy if they happen to come in contact with the pool and cannot be blocked. Uses as a way to create zones where it's hard for opponent to move freely. Yeah, this that move would be great if and like you know you have the life lead and you know time is um you know you're close to ending it so you just want to make sure that uh you know they don't.
they don't like you know move yeah like i said move around freely and um i guess i guess the only question is does she has like good anti-air way too there's an only fall to jump a perfect walk over and yeah that, that looks like a good anti-air right there the one that she did uh, likely as you said, Farmers, I must say it's interesting. Oh, yeah. The corner. That's crazy. <laughs> Does it get them while they're blocking? Toxic Breath. Sasha's for it with Talons while creating a poisonous bubble, then immediately burst. Easy using combos or attack pieces. Yeah, kind of looks like an Ender. The fact that close range best using combos and attack finishes. If using the ladder, you won't suffer a counter attack. But if it's blocked and your opponent can poison, it hits. Wait, say that one more time. Oh wait, it, I think they just answered my question. Do you still get poison if you're blocked? Wait, I gotta read that again. Okay. When you use a combo, it's also hit mid-air opponents, launch an opponent into the air, and follow it with another attack. Wait, does it does it pop up? Um, oh, it pops up air mid-air opponents. Okay. I wasn't reading that last one. Serpent Lash, Stin talons for a short distance to pierce opponents. I get it. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, poison if the attack lands, use from combos as a way of checking opponents from mid range. Okay. Wow, that one, that one goes like pretty far. That must be like a medium version or something. Uh. The light version is. Sublime for mid range space control, triggering toxic blossom with, with this will also send your phone to find a way, allowing you to maintain closing clap. Medium version, yeah, that's what I thought. That's where it's the air. Should have two. Oh, that's crazy. And that version will bring a jump down. You can follow up with attack. Cool. And then you can use use a medium version of that right after that. With this hits. Oh, that's sick. It said, "Get over here." So I'm gonna come to you. <laughs> Yo, she is gonna be. She is gonna be crazy. If the hit opponent is already poisoned, you'll stab them at. After closing in, triggering Toxic Blossom in one fell swoop, a perfect chance to do even more exquisite damage. Oh shit! They did it twice? Cruel Fates. Leap forward into the air. Ooh. It looks like it auto tracks. So the opponent can't counter back. Oh, whoa. If you find the heavy version at the hitch, you can follow with another attack. Just like. If this hits an opponent standing on the ground, it will grab them. Man, that shit hurts. <laughs> Okay, even if it's point blocked, you can have the vanish. You can even input four back. Oh wow, you can change the different distance. Snake sap. Oh, this is the the slithering thing. Where high touch while while moving forward. Surprise blows. Oh well, that's crazy. The heavy version can get behind your opponent, and the light version can perform a feint. Mix of these. 
Oh, okay. So light, medium, okay. Oh, you're gonna be attack. Yeah, okay. Sinister slide. It technically lies just a little further back. Wait, is this the. Oh! Oh, so. Wow, she has a lot of, like, abilities that. That's crazy. So it's it's a a stance that she has that she can um do it looks like three abilities. So. Wow, that is crazy. Deadly implication. Launched upon it in the air with a kick, trapped on a giant bubble puzzle. A counter attack or a follow up. Yeah, I feel like she's gonna be like a real problem. She has so many tools. Her kit is like really good. I uh, send multiple talents for her. Leaves a large trace of poison in this wake. Use her attacking from a distance and poison upon if it hits. Uh, Pawns also become poison if they touch the pool. Uh, range depending on the button press. The light version of lands the closest to you. Okay, so that's cool. Pressing different versions, different buttons, like depends how long the uh, or the bubbles, not bubble, the bubble pool is. Oh, so you really gotta like be be precise with your. That's crazy. That'd be that's a real good ability in the um. Grand type that does sleep is an enemy. The cost is high, so ensure that it's connected before you escape. That's using combos at launch an opponent or immediately after connecting a weapon slash. Once you come to Greece with the attack, you can try to use it as a counter. Whoa! Oh, that's crazy. Oh, this must be the a different version. Wow. Yeah, she's a uh, Aki. I mean, like I said before, she she's toxic. Uh, very impressive. Uh, like kit and like move set. Um, honestly, like, once I get the game, I'm definitely going to, like, you know, play as her, try her out, because she, she definitely looks fun, but she does seem like she, uh, requires a lot of, um, um, uh, a lot of work to, like, a lot of, she requires a lot of effort and, um, time to, like, you know, figure out, like, the combos of it, I mean, but it's like, she has, like, a lot of things that... Oh man, that's just kind of like, you know, it just blows, blows my mind, uh, honestly. Um, but yeah, that's Aki, uh, character guide. Uh, let me know what you guys think if you're interested in like playing her. Uh, I know I am, um, but definitely interested to see like a, like a, the female version of, of Fong or Fang, uh, is like honestly way better, a way more, way more interesting character than, and Fang was or is um but uh yeah 
Uh, let's get into Liza piece now we're done with that. Because the uh, 